Hey you, are you having a good day? So today I'm going to share with you one of my new products in my fall winter 2022 catalog. It's actually had quite a bit of buzz in my VIP group. Everyone is wanting to know about this tote organizer um, and then what all it's going to fit inside of. So I don't know if you remember several years ago, we had a product, product called uh, the Swap It Pocket and the Super Swap It Pocket. So basically what it was was a little organizer that you could put inside of your purse or a tote and you could move it from item to item without having to take every single thing out individually and move over. So that's basically what this is as well. It gives you organization on the inside of your tote and it just helps you feel a little bit better from day to day when everything has its place. So this is called the tote organizer. We have it in two prints. This one is the taupe print. This is the one in the taupe and then here it is in the black. So depending on your purse, uh, as far as cho choosing, you know, colors, I actually prefer the taupe one because it's lighter and you can see down inside of your bag and see what's what and where it is. And um, the black one is also very nice. I'm glad that I have the black one too, because there's a couple of bags that we have that are the, the lining of them is a light color lining. So the, the tote organizer, you know, you can see inside of it as well. But um, if I was choosing a print, I would actually choose the taupe one. So this is um, just a, you know, feel, I don't know what that feel is called, like polyester, what does it say? It doesn't say here. Um, but anyways, so it's got that kind of like a vinyl feel to it. So here's what it looks like on the outside. And then it's kind of like a three section here. So I do have in here um, the tapered pouch as well as a Benjamin's wallet. I'll show that to you in more detail in just a second. So you've got um, a middle divider that is like a little zipper pouch here. So you got this section here. You've got two two uh, elastic pockets here. You also have a little retractable cord here. So if you have this inside of maybe your work tote and you have your work badge to get in the door, you can use this retractable thing and, you know, pull it out and swipe your card or, um, you know, whatever, however you use that. And then also the other side here is same thing, two um, elastic pockets. And then you've got this middle section here to store things. And then the zipper uh, pouch in the middle as well. So you can store all of those little extras in there um, that you need to keep with you. So I'm gonna show you this again with the Benjamin's wallet. So you can see that it kind of takes up, the, I mean, the Benjamin's wallet looks like, you know, like a little tiny thing in here. So this is very, very large. I'll put the tapered pouch back in here as well. And you can see that, but it takes up um, hardly any room in here. So um, the black is very similar. You know, it's just the same thing. It's just in black. So this was actually um, created to fit in a few of our totes. So it was created to fit in the Cindy tote, the quilted commuter tote, and the square tote. But what I found out was that it fits in a lot more totes besides that one. So let's show you the square tote. Now this square tote is actually very, very large. Um, this is uh, going to come back in uh in december but i want to show you this i actually like the black one in here because the interior of this is is the light colored so you can see um and you can actually see in here. So this is the, and there's actually quite a bit, quite a bit more room um, in that square tote. And then here it is in the quilted commuter tote. So here's the quilted commuter tote. Now I prefer the taupe one inside this one because the interior of this one is very, very uh, dark. So let's put it in here and show you what it looks like. So I've got built in organization. So this, a lot of our bags already have organization in them. Um, like this one particularly, you can see some papers in there. That's a little laptop sleeve section, but you also see like the two interior pockets here. But sometimes if you're using this as a mobile office or a work bag, it is so nice to have some more organization in there. So that's it inside of those two. It also fits nicely in the Cindy tote. Oops, I'm pulling out the wrong thing. So just wanted to show you a couple of more that will fit in. So a lot of people are asking me, will it fit inside of the window shopper? No, I'm sorry. It will not fit inside the window shopper. So you can see that it's, well, quite a bit longer inside of here. So it's not, it, it the video's not doing good. But anyways, it won't fit in there. Sorry. Okay, so let's, uh, oh, and then, well, let me show you. I want. I wanted to show you this. So this is the all zipped up crossbody. So like if you were using this as your work bag and you need your all zipped up crossbody, it fits perfectly in there. So when you're going out on your lunch hour or um you know doing a little quick trip, um you can just pull out your your uh, 
all zipped up crossbody and it totally fits in there, which is really nice. So let's show you what it looks like. So here is the casual crossbody tote. I'll put the black one in this one. So now I, if you have this cat, I, I, I can't carry the casual crossbody because I have to have organization. So I could totally carry this casual crossbody if it had some organization on the inside. So this is an unstructured bag. So this would actually help give it a little bit more structure and you would have a lot more pockets on the inside of that. So I would be more inclined to carry this casual crossbody tote if it had the tote organizer in there. Okay, so here is the step up tote. The step up tote, I'm actually gonna put the black one in there because the interior of this one is a light colored. Um, this is a little bit of a snug fit on the inside. So you kinda have to work it in there. I mean, not hard, but you do have to work it in just a little bit, but it does fit on the inside of your step up tote, which is really, really nice. Okay, here it is inside of the, this is the modern tote. So um, again, this is one of those bags that is just kind of like a an open bag and I, an unstructured open bag. And so I like have to have something in here. It's trying to fold up on me, sorry. Give me just a second. Okay, so here it is inside of the modern tote. It will also fit inside of the around town tote, which is um, the version before this one was a little bit taller. It will fit in the around town tote as well, okay? And so let's talk about some of our utility totes, our essential storage tote, just a, a utility tote, all day, every day tote. This will fit on the inside of this. It is a little snug on the sides, but look, You've got organization on the inside of this one. And then also, this tote actually may not need any more pockets. This is the um, Everyday Essentials tote, but it does fit in there. So if you are using this as your work bag, this will fit in the middle. So you know the this Everyday Essentials tote has the six pockets uh, or three on each side and then two mesh pockets. It actually has eight pockets on the inside, but sometimes you may need a little bit more organization. So it does fit there in the middle. So um, lots of ways to use this. One thing, oh, one thing I thought about too is um, you could actually put this inside of your uh, roundabout cooler tote and um, it will fit perfectly in there. You're like, why would you need that inside of a thermal? Well, I was just thinking about, um, you know, uh, photographers who carry or things that you don't want to break that are very fragile. So I was thinking about photographers and their lenses and things like that. When any photographer um, wants me to recommend a bag for them, I always recommend a thermal for them, even though they're not trying to keep things cold or hot, but it has extra padding. And so I thought this would be a great way for um, photographers to keep their things organized. They could put their SD cards in one here. And, um, you know, it's just, a. I thought it was really a good idea, but, um, also great for diaper bags because when you are, uh, when you are a mama and you're carrying all the things like all the, you know, the teething things, the Tylenol, you know, the fingernail clippers, the thermometer, all of those things like this would fit perfectly inside of your diaper bag, especially one of our 31 ones. And, um, would be super nice in there. And I meant to check to see if this would fit inside of a zip top organizing utility tote. I almost feel certain that it would. Um, so I pretty, I mean, I'm like 90% sure that it would fit inside of a zip top organizing utility tote. It'd be great for um, a kid bag. So um, I hope that you love this tote organizer as much as me. I'm so glad to see something like this um, back uh, for us to be able to organize inside of our totes and purses. And you know me, I'm all about having an organized purse everything has its place. So um, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. That way you'll get a notification on your phone when I post a new video. If you're watching today and you do not have a 31 consultant, I want to be your girl. So I'm going to link below all of my contact information. You can get in touch with me and um, I'd love to chat with you and share 31 with you. If you're interested in the business opportunity with 31, making a little extra money, having something just for you. Um, I can answer any questions that you may have about becoming a 31 consultant. Um, also, if you're interested in hosting a party, um, share a shopping link with your friends and your family, get them to, uh, to shop on your link and then you earn hostess rewards off their orders. I can create a shopping link for you in just a few um, minutes, actually seconds, and uh, we can go ahead and get that going for you. So again, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you have a great day. Bye.